today's tech tip is your start page. Now this is not your start button. This is the page your browser goes to when you open your browser, your browser start page. We've pre-programmed for every computer in the district, Internet Explorer to go to Dazzle. So if you deal with student data, all you have to do is open Internet Explorer and the start page goes to the page where you need to be to manipulate or look at student data. Now your computer has at least two other browsers on it. You have Chrome and you have Firefox and you can program the start pages on those browsers to go to whichever page or pages are most useful to you. If you find yourself going out to the staff resources page and using this to go to email or to Schoology or to Safari Montage, you can program your browser to just start on this page and then when your browser opens, the things that you do most, most often can be right there. Now, for the last 10 years, this has been my start page. And uh, I've refined this top left-hand corner to reflect the links that I use the most. I go to these links hundreds of times more often than I go to any other links on the web. So I put them right there in the top left-hand corner. Every computer that I own, when I open a browser, it goes to this page. Even my cell phone, when I open a browser, goes to this page. Let me show you how to set a start page in Chrome. In Chrome, click on the three little lines in the top right-hand corner. That'll drop down a menu where you can select settings. When you open the settings, select open a specific page or set of pages. This will tell your browser, I want to select the pages that open when my browser starts. Once you've selected this option, click on set pages. This is where you can type in those actual pages. You can see my start page. I also open my Gmail and I have a third tab that's open for Google searches. If you have a page you want your browser to go to, and you can see I have three tabs that open when I open my browser. If you have a page you want to use, just put in the URL there. Now, if you make a mistake and you put in something you don't want, just highlight it, click the X, and you get rid of it, try again. But you should make your browser start in the pages that are most useful to you.